Thomas the Tank Engine loves to travel. He sometimes likes to travel to other countries on his big old adventures and is always making new friends along the way. However, his big old friends are always there for him. One morning, Thomas went to Brendan Watt for the delivery when he saw a group of engines waiting for him. Hello everyone, what are you all doing here? Squad Thomas, there's a ship that's coming here all the way from Australia. Australia? Wow, that's on the other side of the world. I know Thomas, I wonder what the surprise could be when the ship arrives. I think I see the ship coming this way. This will be exciting, Cranky! What's in the ship, Cranky? Can you see anything? I see something very long and green, but I'm gonna need some help, Carly. Not a problem, Cranky. I can help you unload this long green thing. As Cranky and Carly unloaded the ship, the engines were very surprised to see who it was. G'day, coppers. I'm Shane the Train and I'm here to entertain. <gasps> it's Shane! He's come from Australia! I remember him! He took part in the strength competition at the Great Railway Show on the mainland! I sure have, mate. So, this place must be the island of Sodor, right? Eh? It sure is, Shane. Welcome to Sodor. Good day, Tomo. Nice to meet you again. Are these your friends? They sure are. This little green engine is Percy, and he's my best friend. Nice to meet you, Shane. My name's Edward, and I was the first tender engine to arrive on Sodor many, many years ago. Hello, Shane. I'm Nia, and I come from Kenya. Wow. What a welcome! It certainly feels good to be on the rails again after cruising along the ocean water for several weeks! Shane, did your ship have to stop in other countries while travelling to Sodor? It certainly did, Tomo. We had to do a few stops at different countries along the way. But boy, it feels good to see you again, mate! Later, the dock manager came to see Thomas and Shane. I need a pair of engines to deliver these trucks to Napford Yards. Okay, sir. We can take those trucks to Napford Yards, won't we, Shane? We sure will, mate. How do we get to this Natford place? You can follow me if you don't know where to go. <laughs> Thomas and Shane were making their way to Napford Yards to their big plans. Thomas was happy his friend Shane had come from Australia to help out for a while. During the trip, Thomas and Shane had a lot to talk about. Shane, how long will you be working on Sodor for? About a month or two. But what have you been up to recently? Nothing much, but I'm certainly glad you've come to visit me on Sodor. I think you're as strong as an elephant. Wow, thanks Tomo. Did you know that elephants are good at shunting rolling stock? I learned that from our Indian friend Ishima and her controller Charabala while I was working on the Indian Railway. How interesting. I didn't know you can mix engines with elephants when it comes to shunting. <laughs> when Thomas and Shane arrived at Captain Yards, was waiting for them. There you are, Thomas. Thanks for delivering those trucks. Oh, and who might this be? Sir, this is my friend Shane. He's come all the way from Australia to help out on Sodo for a while. Good day, sir. Well, uh, good day to you too, Shane. That evening, the engines gathered at the yard for the back controller as he was about to give out some news. 
Tomorrow there will be a spider exhibition at the Sodor Animal Park. There will be lots of people coming to check out these ferocious spiders of Sodor. <gasps> Nia, I need you to go to the docks tomorrow morning to fetch the spider's habitat. Of course, sir. I can take the guests to the animal park if you like, sir. After all, it is built on my branch line, you know. Why, certainly, Edward. There's a lot to do tomorrow, so you must all be very busy. Now then, where is Shane gone to? I need to have a word with him. I think he's hiding in one of the good sheds, sir. Not to worry. I'll talk to him and see what's wrong. Very well then, Thomas. Now everyone else can go back to their sheds and rest for the night. Okay, sir. I might as well take the mail train now. What's wrong, Shane? Oh, uh, Thomas, I, uh, didn't see you there. Oh, what a surprise. Are you hiding something from me? <sighs> yes, Thomas. Your controller said there was a spider exhibition tomorrow, and I really don't like spiders. Nonsense! Why would a big steamy like you be afraid of such a tiny insect? It's not how small they are. The spiders we have in Australia are very deadly and dangerous. There are spiders with red backs that tend to sacrifice people's lives, and I must be careful when I see a spider nearby. Really? I don't think the spiders on soda are dangerous from our point of view. But we do know that our rally car friend Ace is afraid of wild animals. Exactly, Tomo. Ace has adrexophobia, while I have arachnophobia, meaning we have fears of spiders and strange creatures. Well, Ace did overcome his fear of wild animals when he did his super stunt jump while I was in your country. Uh, let's not talk more about phobias, please, Thomas. I just need to have some much needed rest, and you should get going back to your sheds too if you want some sleep. Alright Shane, I'll see you tomorrow. As Thomas was making his way back to Tickle's sheds to sleep, an idea came to his funnel. If I go to the Whistling Woods to look for some spiders, I can prove to Shane that the spiders on soda aren't as deadly as the ones in Australia. I can even find some that would look good enough to be on display at the spider exhibit tomorrow. The next morning, Thomas came to a junction where the left track took him to the Whistling Woods as his adventure had just begun. Now let's go spider hunting! The woods were very dark. Thomas was determined not to give up. Oh, there's got to be some spiders around here, but hopefully it won't take too long. Meanwhile, Shane was making a delivery to the docks. He saw that Thomas wasn't there. G'day fellas, anyone seen Tomo around? Sorry matey, not since yesterday. So uh, why do you have to find Thomas for? It's so I can talk more about my arachnophobia. Well, that's quite a long word. We can hardly understand what it means, shipmate. It means fear of spiders. I saw Thomas not long ago. You have, little green cobber? He told me about your fear of spiders and said he was going to the Whistling Woods to look for some. The Whistling Woods? Well, take me there at once, please. <laughs> At the dark, whistling woods, Thomas continued his adventure. He looked around for some spiders, but there were so many trees that he couldn't look properly. There's got to be a single spider around here. I just know it. Then there was trouble. Ooh! Oh, cinders and ashes! I'm stuck! I can't move my wheels! I have to whistle for help! <gasps> the 
listen to that, Percy. Do you hear that noise? I know that noise. It's Thomas's whistle. He must be in trouble. Well then, we've got no time to lose. Help! Someone help! I can't get back on the tracks! Percy, is that you? Hello? Is that someone coming? I hope it's my friends Percy and Shane. I see Thomas, and it looks like he's stuck! Good spotting, mate! <gasps> Percy! It's you! Oh, thank goodness you've heard my whistle! I was worried about you, Thomas! How did you end up in this predicament? You see, I was trying to look for some spiders so I could prove to Shane that the spiders on Sodor aren't as dangerous as the ones in Australia. There you are, Tomo! Uh, are you alright? I will be once you pull me back on the track. As Shane turned around to pull Thomas back on the rails, Percy noticed something that gave him a surprise. Look, Thomas! There's a giant cobweb connected between two trees! A giant cobweb? <gasps> that must be when we found a spider in the Whistling Woods! Spiders? Where? It's alright, Shane. Look! This spider isn't dangerous. In fact, this is its home. You see? There's nothing to worry about with spiders if they're not dangerous on Sodor. Oh, I guess you're right, Thomas. I suppose not every spider is deadly and sacrificing from what I've seen. <laughs> <laughs> Later that day, Thomas, Percy and Shane had arrived at the animal park, where Mia, Edward and the vacuum corner were there waiting. Where have you been, Thomas? The spider exhibit is about to begin. Sorry, sir. I wanted to prove to Shane that not all spiders are dangerous unlike the ones in his country, Australia. It's true, sir. I actually have arachnophobia, meaning I have a fear of spiders. But then I realised Tomo taught me that he was right all along. Is that right, Thomas? Yes, sir. Now we can all enjoy the spider exhibition at the animal park. And I hope you can enjoy your stay on Sodor until you're ready to go home again, Shane. That's the spirit, Tomo. <laughs> 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 Ha 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 ha!